senior Jordan Wolf is spending his summer days inside this computer lab, but he's not complaining. So far, I'm very intrigued by it. Um, I really like the work. Jordan and business analytics professor Aaron Miller are enjoying the opportunity to research and get to the bottom of all of this data. The data file actually has upwards of 92 million observations. The data comes from California, which includes inpatient and emergency room visits. They're trying to use a methodological approach to find patterns in the data and to identify when doctors misdiagnose people. The, the end goal is actually to build or to develop some sort of recommender system that could be implemented in a hospital setting where um, you would have some sort of uh, clinical decision support system where physicians, which they're currently using, where they enter patient information and they'll give them recommendations about potential diagnoses where you could actually implement within that system something that pops up like a red flag that says, hey, based on this pattern of diagnoses or th this patient showing up this number of times with these diagnoses, this recommender system would actually suggest, hey, there's a likelihood that um, this patient might have something else or might be being, being misdiagnosed. These two know they have a lot of work to do to get to that end goal. They'll sift through the data for several different diseases. Right now we're looking at all of the codes that came back that people had a diagnosis of HIV and then looking prior to that diagnosis to see some sort of pattern of if they could have been diagnosed sooner. Professor Miller says many other businesses use data in this way, but it's new to healthcare. So we're doing a lot of uh, data processing and handling data and writing code and um, putting data together. Um, we're also doing a lot of model building. Um, and so it brings together a lot of different topics within analytics that I think is um, makes it a really good learning experience, um, but at the same time it's a real world problem. It's um, on the frontier of research. Professor Miller says misdiagnoses are a hot topic and the number one cause of malpractice claims. So they're going to continue digging into the data right here on the Cornell College campus hoping to make a difference. If it does work, it could really make a difference to like I said, even just with HIV, if you can catch it a year sooner and they can get on all of the drugs that we have now to slow the process of going to AIDS, it could save a lot of people's lives. This is just one story detailing all of the summer research projects going on at Cornell College. Watch for others on the Cornell College News Center or follow us on Facebook for more information.